Two on the final in the regular season finale here at Gila River Arena. We're still digesting it here on Coyotes Live, presented by CenturyLink. The Ducks defeating the Arizona Coyotes. Follow me here, folks, as I take you on a flashback here. There's a lot of Arizona Wildcat fans that are sort of high on the horse after winning the Pac-12 South, taking the Territorial Cup back home, and then making it back to the Fiesta Bowl. But I'm here to tell you that there were some good times in the early 90s as they defeated the Hurricanes. One of my favorite moments in Arizona Wildcat history. In the 1994 Fiesta Bowl, it should have been about 40 nothing. They kicked a bunch of field goals. Why do we bring that up? Why do we bring that up? Well, there was a guy on the field that actually joins me now. Speaking of the lottery, I used to be able to call him Tony Bowie All-American. I used to be able to call him Tony Bowie, oh, let's see, All-Conference, Conference Champion in football and baseball. But now I have to call you Director Bowie because you are the Executive Director, my friend, of the Arizona Lottery. Congratulations. Thanks for coming on here on our final show. It's been oh, kinda, no, thanks. I... It, it's been going off the tracks here, so you got to help me bring it back, okay? <laughs> I don't know if you noticed that. We're having some fun here today. No, no, I'm excited to be here. Listen, before we talk about the lottery, I do want to do one other flashback, and this is a, this is under full full candor here. I want to show you a photo, and Tony, I'm, I know that you will live with this forever. The cover of Sports Illustrated back in the day after winning that Fiesta Bowl. There it is, Desert Swarm, Rock Look at those Solid. guns. I was going to say that, but you brought it up. Hey, those guns are big. I, I will tell you, I was working at a rock station in Phoenix at the time, and, and a lot of people there knew that I was an Arizona Wildcat alum. And that was not not an easy day to come to work when that came out. I just want you to know that, okay? Yeah, it, it was it was frightful for me too when I when I saw it. <laughs> yes. I said that's in perpetuity now. It will, it will never go away. Yes. And then that trip to Penn State, they did they dug it a little deep yeah, on me here. But they you did. guys you guys wore that very well. So congratulations. Well, we thank could, you. We could talk for hours about what you're doing in your life and times, father teacher, cancer survivor, but I want to talk about your, your your job now with the Arizona State Lottery. You were down on the ice earlier, Tony, and I thought yep. it was appropriate for you because you gave out the hardest working player award. If anyone understands what hard work is about, you put it in in your career, did you not? You get it, don't you? Yeah, I, I completely get it, and we were really excited to present that award um, and it, it, the Arizona Lottery has been a partner with the Coyotes for three years now and two years for that award. And me being, you know, my background being a hard worker and kind of a, a you know, a, a guy that overachieved, um, I'm really excited about that award. And that's a great award for Coyote fans because it's in the name of Yuka Neiman and their, their late massage therapist. There's a reason why that award is named after him. But then it was also a check that you gave out to Shane Doan. That's another part of this unique partnership, is it not? It, absolutely. Absolutely. We, because of uh, our partnership, we've given over uh, four thousand um, dollars to to the foundation mm -hmm. uh, because of Shane Doan's uh, uh, goals. So we've, we're excited about giving those checks as well. Well, let's talk a little bit more about what you guys do, Tony, because I know it is incumbent upon the lottery to find a way to give back to the community, and you've been doing that in leaps and bounds, billions of dollars since 1981. So yes. where where does that money go? I think a lot of people don't really realize they focus so much on the winning, and I get it. Yeah. But where does yeah. the money go? Yeah. How do you give back? What do you, you do? You know, the Arizona Lottery is much more than just scratcher tickets and Powerball tickets. I mean, we give back billions of dollars, 3.3 since we've been started. Uh, you, if you dive uh, deep into that, it's 3.4 per week. Um, and so we're excited about every time that somebody plays, every time that somebody buys a ticket, yes, they're trying to win, you know, that dream, but every time they're they are also giving back to the Arizona community. I was just going to say the four pillars we showed them on the screen, education, health and public welfare, environment, economic and business development. I can't frankly imagine, Director Boy, this state without the infrastructure that you guys help provide to bring that money back. I really can't. It seems like yeah. it's been yeah. around forever, but in true, it hasn't, right? Yeah, it, it hasn't. You know, 81, when they we started the lottery, uh, just this past fiscal year, we gave $175 million back to the state of Arizona in certain areas. Um, in particular, we gave back to the uh, the Heritage Fund. Yep. Um, so we give a lot of money to, the, to that foundation. Uh, they helped uh, get the bald eagle off of the, the endangered species list because yep. of of the money that we were able to give back to the Harris Fund. Well, I know that your focus is going to be on a lot of that, so I'm imagining you and I will be talking again in the future, and I hope that's indeed the case. It's great to see you again. I was worried about you there for a while. I yeah, know you're doing yeah, well. I'm doing well. Life marches on, and so do you. So congratulations, Director Bowie. I wish you all the best. <laughs> Keep in touch, okay? I absolutely will. Thanks okay. a lot. And the guns look good on that side. Yeah, uh, they, they still good. They're, they're a little smaller now, yeah, but... That's okay. 
The Desert Swarm will live in perpetuity as well. <laughs> All, right. All right, there he is. He is the director, the executive director of the Arizona Lottery, Tony Bowie, joining us here. Great pond to sponsorship, uh, of course, with the Arizona Coyotes and great partners of us here on Fox Sports Arizona. It's great to have him here on our final show. We'll take a break. More to come here on this Saturday night. And